the thing about me and heights is that whenever I'm in like a very high place I just feel dizzy like right now actually I feel a bit dizzy and my heart is pounding um, I don't know I remember like when I was going up these days it just felt like okay I'm getting higher and higher I don't know what the thing is with going to high places so um, I recall in 2013 um, this is when I actually discovered that I had a fear of heights. I went to um, a place called Hobbiton and Hawksback uh, with my then boyfriend. So um, on our first day, we went there for a weekend. So on our first day, um, they welcomed us and then they wanted to, us to make to, to to do like some of the courses that they have there. So they took us to zip lining. Zip lining is not even that um, hectic, but I remember not like resisting um, doing the thing. And obviously the whole point of us, of going there was for us to have fun. The only thing that I ever did was just go to the Madonna and Child because I was like walking um, to the waterfalls. So um, from zip lining, they tried all sorts of things. They told me that it's very safe. They put um, those safety things and um, I think the last, I think what made me panic was that I could feel them as I was sitting down and ready to um, move with the thing. I just felt them, it was like they were going to push me. So that's when I resisted. I was like, no guys, I just panicked and I was like, no, I can't do it. And, and the thing with me with this feeling is that I just get overwhelmed. Like, okay, I want to cry. I really don't know. And feel, sometimes I feel my legs like getting um, weak and yeah, and I start sweating sometimes. So um, from then on, that was the Friday. I didn't do anything um, that has that had anything to do with heights. So on a Saturday, I think we just walked to the waterfalls. On the Sunday, then we did more um, obstacle courses. They took us. You will see, like in Hobbiton, when you, I think there by the gates, there's like um, these things where you have to jump on high ropes and all of that. So there was that activity, and they were like, okay, maybe today you're feeling a bit better. Maybe you're gonna want to do this. And I was like, these people just don't understand that I don't like heights. So they made me do that. I was like, no, I'm not going to do this thing. And then um, my then boyfriend again um, did that thing alone. Um, so the same year, 2013, we went there with the whole class, now my grade 11 class. So people didn't know that I had been there before. So with all the challenges and all the courses that we were told to do, I was like, <laughs> I already knew the ones that I wasn't going to do because, you know, I already knew them. And um, I remember my, my, my classmates asking me like, ah, dude, can't partake and whatnot, like trying to push me. And I was like, no, I'm not doing this because I've been here before, blah, blah, blah. And they never really understood like what the fear is. Like it's really nothing. And people take it very lightly. Like it's nothing. You're just going up and you're going down. We're going to support you. You're going to hold your hand. Just the fear. I just got terrified by the fact that, okay, I'm going to be looking down and I'm um, Basically, I'm a few meters above the ground, so I think maybe it's just the comfort of, of walking on the ground and not being um, a certain meter or whatever above um, the ground. Not quite because even now that I'm standing here, I feel a bit um, <laughs> shaken, but I'm trying to be strong. Hence, I'm, I have my hands on knees um, because I don't know, I think the most terrifying part will be when I have to walk down here. Walking up is not really a challenge for me, but looking down and having to go down the road um, is always a challenge. I don't know. Um, I wouldn't say I've fully overcome the challenge, I've fully overcome the fear, but I think this is like a step towards that. Like, like I, on a normal day, or I, I wouldn't just walk up here. I'd, I'd avoid anything that has to do with walking up um, the stairs. And especially this, it's very rusty, so I wouldn't do this. Just, you know. So, yeah.